Hello and welcome to this tell and guide on setting up DHCP option 66. As an overview, option 66 will pass a provision link to any phone on your network after it's received an IP, at which point the phone will then provision itself, circumventing the need to manually attach the provisioning link into each phone's web interface. Keep in mind, some phones need to have option 66 capabilities enabled manually. For this demo, we will be using a Windows-based DHCP server with a SNOMD 785 provision via STUN. Additionally, we will be demoing both global and reservation scope options where global scope passes the provision link to any DHCP client on your network and reservation which restricts this to specific clients based on their IP and MAC address. Starting off on our 3CX management console, we're first going to attach and configure our phone under an extension using the relevant template and phone's Mac. After which, we'll be given the provisioning link. We'll keep this handy for later. We can now head on to our Windows Server Server Manager to configure option 66. Starting off with Global Scope, we're going to navigate to Tools, then DHCP. We can now expand to IPv4 and right click Options, and now select Configure Options. And here we can enable option 66 and use our provisioning link as our string value. Now that option 66 is enabled, we can simply boot up our phone and it will automatically configure itself. Using Reservation Scope is a similar process with a few additional steps. First off, we're gonna navigate to Scope, then click Reservations and select New Reservation. We can enter any name as this is only to identify our reservation. Then we can enter the IP and MAC of the phone. And we can repeat this process for any additional phones you have. Now that our reservation is created, we can right click our new reservation and select Configure Options. Now select Option 66 and use the provisioning link as the string value. You can now boot the phone to allow it to download its configuration. Keep in mind, some phones cannot download their configuration via HTTP or HTTPS, in which case you need a TFTP server hosting the configuration files, and you would then point option 66 at the IP of this TFTP server. And this concludes our walkthrough on using DHCP option 66 to configure your IP phones. If you have any further questions, please feel free to contact us at 844-448-3546 or through email at sales at